Hey boys, welcome to Mass Games. My name is Simon. It's a prototype. This is a Castle Con, currently called Garden, or Gardeners, or something like that. And as you can see, I do have a shadow behind me. This is a game which takes about 45 minutes, and it happens over 14 rounds. It's set up as a four. You can do one of four actions. You're going to take on these items. They look something like this. And what you're going to do is it allows you to do stuff. So trying to get points, you get points for pretty much everything you do. This allows you to move your dropper down, which can give you more points. Get down to the bottom. Three points per book, which I'll talk to you about. Over here, you can get points per eggs, which I'll talk to you about. And you get points based on bees, which I'll talk to you about. Over here, we have a frog, which again can trigger more actions as well. Follow the arrows to do different things. Frogs start down here. As you can see, you get more bees. You have a bird. A bird can fly off from its nest. It can pick up a dingleberry, aka a piece of stick. And when it comes back, so another time you move a bird back, you get one of these eggs. They're face down. So you might get a four or five or a three. And lastly, you can move one of your insects as well. So someone's going to start then pick one of those. If they took this one, everything else moves along, they get a new one out, and then it moves to the next player's turn. So naturally, you can see what you want to do. What can you take? Well, you might have seen for those pictures over there, you can take one of these. So this has got me one point because it's one level up, but more of them gets me more points. Over here, you get complete sets. So I have two of these, so I get four points for each of these as they're fulfilled. And I get one point, so I've got one point here. So one, that's worth four, that's worth one, a four and a one. So four, four, one, one, one makes 11 points. Also, when you complete one of these with birds or bees, you get one of these tokens. So I get two points at the end of the game because I've got two ladybirds. I get also points with these ones, which are these. So one, two, three, four. Finally, what else do we have? Dragonflies, which is not go for. You can't go for everything in this game. Two points pretty much for dragonflies is kind of how it works. Over here, you also got some leaves, which I didn't really go on, it's got me nothing. Over here, I did go for. So I scored seven points, I scored two points, I scored one point, plus, like in Seven Wonders, a set of, it also had three points. Over here, you have to have a different type each turn. So, for example, a web can come off it, but you can't have these dots, so you can have other ones, which have got drips, and also leaves. And what else do we have? Also, points for leaves, points for leftover sticks. That pretty much sums it up. My final score, as you can see, 58 points as you came last. So when you do take one of these, you have to wait. So you can't really take a turn until you know what else is coming. Typically, you kind of know what you want to focus on, but you do need to wait until if there's a better optimal turn. In my instance, I was making sure someone else wasn't taking those of these, so I could. Obviously, it's a bit swingy, potentially, these points. What these, by the way, give you are obviously extra items. This is where you store them. The higher the frog gets as well, you get more points as well. That's pretty much it in 2 minutes 40. And for now, uh, yeah, it's an interesting game. I'm with the designer. The designer is Chronicles of Avil, which I do have in German, which I will be bringing to the channel soon. So like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. And for now, in this 4K recording, back to the table.